Hello friends and welcome to this new session of the Kubernetes troubleshooting. My name is Alok Kumar and today we are going to discuss on the troubleshooting of the Kubernetes day 7. So we already provided the 6 video for this series. So you can see the 6 videos. If you didn't watch my previous video on the Kubernetes troubleshooting, you can uh, watch it. So these all are for the different subject and how to troubleshoot and how to fix we pro also provided the complete demo okay so we are going to discuss uh, today with the new error that is service not reachable so sometimes you find that you deploy the applications perfectly fine you have the services you have the ingress you have the route 53 is there you have the its routing it have the record set which routing the traffic to the load balancer which routing the traffic to the ingress after that ingress the service is uh, it's routing the appropriate services and the services is linked with the deployment where the it's serving deployment is serving the pods and uh, whatever the replica sets count you have okay but uh, the applications have the problem that you it's appear that the page uh, is not working so in that case what is the problem when it causes and why it cause and how to fix so we are going to discuss uh, on this in more details so service it is not reachable and you find these types of page may occurred when you're trying to access your applications okay which is running in the pod so when it occurs so there might be uh, some deployment issues okay so deployment issues Maybe after you deploy an applications, uh, if uh, the associated service cannot be accessed, Kubernetes may report a service not reachable. So what happens? Let me uh, draw a diagram. So suppose you have uh, route 53 or maybe you have only the load balancer. Okay. So if you have the route 53, suppose you have a, a domain name you available that is a, have the record set with your load balancer. Okay. And this load balancer is routing the traffic to your ingress, which have some rules defined for which particular address, which services to go. So there are lots of services here. Okay. You may have uh, more than one uh, ingress so you can find in your environment so there are lots of ingresses and each ingresses is linked with the lot of services so you can see that this is the service one service two service three okay accordingly service four so whatever it is so this service is linked with the deployment suppose uh, d1 and this is linked with the different deployment d2 and each have its own own replica suppose it's serving two ports it's serving only one ports and d3 is serving three ports and we have some critical applications so so you can say the main applications okay so d4 it's serving 10 ports as per your requirement okay and this is the deployment which have the linking with the ports uh, at the behind the scene it's have the replica set okay so because whatever the replica you define the replica sets uh, try to balance uh, the um, meet the expectation okay so you have the pod here suppose it's have the two then you have the two pods p1 and p2 so here we have you have the applications whatever applications you have abc so these applications when we hit the url suppose uh, abc.com okay then it will go to the load balancer load balancer will uh, go for the ingress so whatever the suppose we have the abc.health okay so it will route the traffic to the service 3 because the ingress have the rules okay so it routing the traffic to the service 3 it's routing the traffic to the health uh, deployment okay and it's serving for the three ports so it will fetch the applications content from any of the port p1 p2 and p3 so if there have any configurations problem in this 
particular diagram so you can't able to see your applications running and you will face this type of problem okay so we are going to discuss on the deployment issues okay now the service uh, delivery problems so if the service endpoint are not correctly registered or resolved within the kubernetes then you will uh, this this will cause the problem or uh, the network configurations either so any types of misconfiguration in the network policies or the firewall rule can block access to the service so this also cause the similar issues okay pod or services crashed somehow if the pod associated with the service are not running or uh, failing to start the service becomes uh, unreachable and the, this the, you already know that because service is here you see, can see the service is the main or you can say each of the part is the main so any part have any problem then it will not uh, bring that particular applications to uh, for browsing to the customer okay so why this occur okay so maybe there is incorrect service selector okay the service may not correctly selected the backend pod due to an incorrect selector or level mismatch okay pod re readiness problem pod might not be ready uh, due to any readiness probes failing or startup issues they, they also cause due to the network policies restrictive network policies or firewalls can block traffic to the services dns issues uh, services uh, discovery failure due to the dns misconfiguration or failure or service mismatch po port mismatch suppose the pod is serving uh, the traffic at a different pod and you configured in the services with a different pod so it will not the route the traffic to the correct pod the exposed pod in the services specifications or port might not match the container port the targeted one where the application is listening that cause the problem so now the common cause and how to recognize this cause and how to fix it okay so in this uh, scenario we are going to discuss in more detail after that we have a demo for this so incorrect service selected labels uh, why what is the cause for this service selector in the service yaml does not match the label of the pod okay so this is the cause we know the cause now how to fix it so to fix it the correct the selector in the services definitions to match the label of the pods okay so you have to use the correct uh, matching labels now the pod uh, readiness issues and what is causing it pods are not ready to serve the traffic as for example due to the failing of the readiness probes so how to fix it check the pod log and events like you can uh, run the command cube cutl uh, describe pod with the pod name for errors and fix the uh, startup issues or ad adjust the readiness probes so in this way you can fix this types of problem if you know the cause of the error okay now the network policies or firewall rules okay so what is cause restrictive network policies or firewall rules blocking the traffic to the services how to fix it to fix it review and adjust the network policies or firewall rules to allow traffic to reach the services so if your traffic is not able to reach the services okay then this will cause the problem or maybe there is some network policies that you apply to the pod that restricting that services to access the application from the pod so there might be different ways dns resolutions problem dns misconfigurations or failure prevent the services discovery how to fix it check the dns settings in the kubernetes and ensure dns resolutions is working properly or not and accordingly you can overcome this problem so now i am jumping to the demo uh, to demonstrate uh, and uh, also i am going to replicate this scenario and how to fix it we are going to see in the demo sections okay so watch this video video till end so you will get uh, to learn a lot uh, about the kubernetes and in this diagram if you don't have the dns so you can uh, understand from the load balancer things so we are not going to configure root 53 
we have the load balancer which serving the traffic to the ingress so in that in my example we, we don't have the ingress as well we are just my load balancer have the linking with the services and these services have the linking with the deployment and the deployment whatever the replica account we have it's serving the traffic for the to access the applications okay so now jumping to the lab section so this is our eks uh, environment where we have two nodes okay of type uh, t2 small and we have uh, one eks client which have uh, all the appropriate roles to access the kubernetes cluster so let me connect with this environment So here you can see that we have uh, three ports currently running. Okay, so what is the deployment? So if you see the port name, the first uh, uh, name before the dash. Okay, so this is the deployment name, and this is the replica set name, and this is the port name. So in this way. you can uh, differentiate between what is the name of the deployment and the replica set and the pod okay so cube ctl get flow pod so we are in the default name space so nginx deployment so pod is serving the three for the three uh, the three pod and it's uh, all the pod are currently running so do we have any service here cube ctl get svc the sort code so this is the default one kubernetes we have one services and this is the load balancer so if you see in this uh, console you will find one load balancer exist so this is the load balancer so when i click on it let me try to access the applications so you can say that the page is not working okay so let me describe the services first so you can see that uh, this particular have the type load balancer this service have the type load balancer but one problem it's not uh, routing the traffic it don't have any end point uh, available here so let me see the deployment and then we are uh, having uh, to check we will check the services okay so ls we have the deployment and the services file as well so let me cat the deployment so the deployment uh, have the name nginx deployment okay and here in the selector we have the match labels of nginx app okay and the replica count is 3 and the match uh, your metadata labels is also same so deployment don't have any problem the container port is serving the on the port 80 that's why we are not able to pass uh, any port because the default port is 80 okay let me describe or cat the services one let me compare both so the match label is in genx app okay so here you can see that the problem is with that the service is not recognized or the service don't have the end point so in that case the service don't know for to which port it have to route the traffic from which port which port is linked currently this service don't have any linking with any of the port because of the selector mismatch so if you see the app is nginx so we don't need to map with the container we need to map with the match labels selector the it should be nginx app here so we need to modify the services because i see the problem with uh, the services itself because we also identified there is no end point and this will is due to this problem so app 
ओके लेट मी सेव इट कैट सर्विसेज जस्ट टू सी द चेंजेस सो सर इंजन एक्स ऐप एंड दिस इज ऑल्सो इंजन एक्स ऐप सो नाउ इट्स लुक्स लाइक दैट द सर्विसेज हैव द यू कैन से द हार्ड बॉन्डिंग विद द डिप्लॉयमेंट सो ऑल द सर्विसेज if the services is it um, traffic will hit then the, that services will route uh, or you can say the route the traffic to the pod okay appropriate pod and we can verify it as well so let me describe it again so here we don't have the end point because of the reason we we did the changes but we didn't apply it yet qctl apply minus f services okay so now it's applied now you can describe the services again so you can see that we have the three ports and all the three ports ports ip is now currently visible to us so if i browse the applications again so maybe the inco incognito may mode because it's uh, cast the data let me run it in a incognito mode so you can see that it's a we the page the applications is nginx and now we are able to access from the load balancer okay so hope this video help you to understand the concept if you like my effort uh, please subscribe to my channel if you didn't subscribe it share it this channel link in your friends group okay and if you have any other comments related to this video or any of the video uh, put the message in the comment section i will definitely try to reply it have a nice day thank you